Object Detection versus Image Segmentation. Hi, everybody. If you're looking to become a full-time data scientist and artificial intelligence AI expert from scratch, then you are at the right place. Today, I'll explain the difference between object detection and image segmentation. <laughs> Some computer vision models can detect objects, determine their shape and predict the direction in which they will travel. For example, such models are at work in self-driving cars. Three important tasks undertaken by computer vision are Classification Object detection Image segmentation Classification is a machine learning task for determining which objects are in an image or video. It refers to training machine learning models with the intent of finding out which classes, objects, are present. Classification is useful at the yes-no level of deciding whether an image contains an object or not. A separate task from classification is localization, or determining the position of the classified objects in the image or video. Object recognition is the technique of identifying the object present in images and videos. It is one of the most essential applications of machine learning and deep learning. The goal of this field is to teach machines to understand, recognize, the content of an image just like humans do. When we talk about object detection, we generally talk about bounding boxes. Bounding boxes are generally defined by the position of the top left corner and a width and height. The logic of object detection by bounding boxes can be understood if we go back to the task, identify all humans on a picture. The first intuition of a solution could be to cut the image in small parts and apply on each sub-image an image classification to say whether this image is a human or not. Classifying a single image is an easier task and of object detection, therefore, they took this step-by-step -step approach. Currently speaking, the YOLO model has been a great invention that solves this problem. The developers of the YOLO model have built a neural network that is capable of doing the whole bounding box approach at once. Current best models for object detection are YOLO, Faster RCNN. You may face two major challenges while working on object detection, those are, in object detection, the bounding boxes are always rectangular. So, it does not help with determining the shape of objects if the object contains the curvature part. Object detection cannot accurately estimate some measurements such as the area of an object, perimeter of an object from an image. Image segmentation is a further extension of object detection in which we mark the presence of an object through pixel-wise masks generated for each object in the image. This technique is more granular than bounding box generation because this can help us in determining the shape of each object present in the image. This granularity helps us in various fields such as medical image processing, satellite imaging, etc. There are primarily two types of segmentation. Semantic segmentation, it refers to the process of linking each pixel in the given image to a particular class label. For example in this image the pixels are labeled as car, tree, pedestrian etc. These segments are then used to find the interactions between various objects. Instance segmentation, here, we associate a class label to each pixel similar to semantic segmentation, except that it treats multiple objects of the same class as separate entities. There's another advanced type of segmentation known as panoptic segmentation. It is a combination of instance and semantic segmentation in a way that we associate with each pixel two values, its class label and an instance number. It also recognizes the sky, the road, and other background elements collectively known as stuff. The logical alternative for scanning the image step by step is to stay away from drawing boxes, but rather to annotate an image pixel by pixel. If you do this, you are going to have a more detailed model, which is basically a transformation of the input image. The idea is basic, even when scanning a barcode on a product, it is possible to apply an algorithm that transforms the input by applying all sorts of filters so that all information other than the barcode sequence becomes invisible in the final picture. This is the basic approach of locating a barcode on an image but is comparable to what happens in image segmentation. The return format of image segmentation is called a mask, an image that has the same size as the original image, but for each pixel, it has simply a boolean indicating whether the object is present or not present. It can be made more complicated if we allow for multiple categories. The discussed object recognition techniques can be utilized in many fields such as driverless cars, object recognition is used for detecting road signs, other vehicles, etc. Medical image processing, object recognition and image processing techniques can help detect disease more accurately. 
For example, Google AI for breast cancer detection detects more accurately than doctors. Surveillance and security, such as face recognition, object tracking, activity recognition, etc. If you're interested in learning more about starting a machine learning and AI career, then be sure to check out our courses at the first link in the description. Code implementation of object detection and segmentation using Detectron 2 and Python video course coming this Wednesday. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos helping you to start your data science and AI career and more. Check out this playlist of our data science and machine learning lessons and see you in the next video. Take care.